here is video number 11 of the TARDIS console build. I'm back at Jay's here. We're gonna work on doing a couple things with the console base here. Mainly, we wanna put, you know, finish up on the core. Let me put this up high here so you can put the core here, which will help it basically stop from twisting. Then we're gonna work on the central core at the top so we can get the ribs ready to go in. Maybe even make the ribs. I don't know what else we're doing today, but we'll see where we get and uh, let's get at it. All right, so just a small little update for what we did today, just a small little build day. But so far, just so you can see right here, we added the core to this and this is the base. And so we have the inside core. So all that's left on here really is get the acrylic tubes and of course get it all ready. Now we decided to go a little higher up here because I'm probably gonna add some uh, plugs or whatever as, as we start adding the panels. And that way we can kind of go with it. But you can see how it goes. Whoop. There we go. Pretty happy. Plus, I wanted to give it a little, little, hint, little, little look. Uh, mostly, just to let you see it here. This is not done. It doesn't account for the trend that's on it right now. But I wanted to show you, and that is how this part's looking. Mostly because I know this is the part most of people are going to be pretty excited about. Take a look at that. So we have the M shape that we, we got CNC cut at Jamie's. And as you can see, it's in here. Now, this is gonna be about a half inch higher up, all said and done, um, mostly because of the panels. I'll show you with this piece right here. This is about the size of the panels and it'll be sitting like this. So as you can see, not quite right. <laughs> but that's just because it's not quite there yet. So this was just a pretty much just as a test to get an idea about how, the M piece was gonna look on here. Um, again, I don't know what the actual term is for these, what, what the prop department calls them, but I call them M pieces only because, well, they look like M's. So, so anyway, that's the update. We're just starting to get ready to go everywhere, mainly to figure out how this is all going together. That's where we're at right now. So we gotta, gotta do some little more figuring and figure out how everything interacts with the base. Now that the base is pretty much 90% done, it's more just figuring out angles and figures. So basically, just to give a quick rundown of my thoughts, uh, for those of you that really like to hear them, we're gonna create windows or frames, six of them, uh, probably out of plywood or one by threes or something like that, which will come up about 23 inches up here. What that will allow us to do is slide in the arms in, uh, the, uh, the ribs, as I like to keep calling them, and they will go in there to create the frame of everything. Then the bottom drawers will go in, which we're gonna have a whole video on that, I'm sure. And then the top drawers on top of that. So just kind of figuring everything out, mostly because of how everything goes in here. And I started to mark it on here, um, just to see how it goes. But anyway, that's a small little video update. Hope you've enjoyed so far. I'm really enjoying this. This is a lot of fun. I can't wait to actually get this to the point where it gets to be painted. Really, that's, that's the part I can't wait for. But uh, thanks to Jay for figuring everything out. Just getting our heads wrapped around some of the 3D. So maybe, maybe I'll have to look up some more help for that. But uh, anyway, if you have any questions at all, be sure to just ask me in the comments below. Um, we're getting to the point, we're getting to the point where this more stuff's gonna happen. So keep abreast of that. And to do that, be sure to click over here and subscribe, click on my new logo there and uh, keep up with everything. It's gonna be a lot more fun and there's gonna be a lot more videos for sure. And if you wanna keep up with me on social media, be sure to look at uh, my Twitter, Facebook fan page, and of course my Instagram, where sometimes they even post pictures before they even go up on the video. So uh, keep touch that way. But anyway, thank you so much for liking and subscribing. Most of all, thanks for watching.